I was body shamed in high school. I was teased for looking like a boy. I've always had an athletic build. I embrace who I am and I'm not ashamed of being all woman, but being strong and being a figure of strength. I think it's important that women know who they are and aren't afraid to stand up for that. I feel like women are very underestimated athletically, being that I'm Latina. You know, you're supposed to have the big hips and the curves. Women come in different shapes and forms and we're all beautiful and I'm beautiful. There's nothing I'm not able to do. I've always had an athletic build, so sometimes I, I didn't fill out tank tops the right way or I couldn't wear certain outfits because my calves were bigger or my body was more athletic than your, your typical female with, you know, big chest and a giant butt and skinny legs. We're living in such an influential world nowadays that strong is now beautiful and, and strength is confidence and strength is showing that you, you care about yourself. Are there any parts of my body that I'm particularly insecure about? Yes, women especially, we have insecurities and it's really our own making. If you kind of start to look at that insecurity as that imperfection that makes you perfectly you, then it changes your perspective on the insecurity. It's your life, your rules, and find your way to, to really embrace that and run with it. When I was younger, I used to get ridiculed in school, like I was too skinny, and I was taller than most of the boys when I was in elementary school and growing up. The bullies made me stronger. As an athlete, I think we push ourselves all the time. Every time I ask my body to do something, it responds. It just reminds me of how powerful I am, sometimes way more than I think. I love my body because this is the best version of what my body type can look like. It took me getting older that I was like, you know, I, I like how I am. I like having big legs. I like having wide shoulders. You know, I, I like those things now. Every person in the world, no matter how perfect their body is perceived, is going to be body shamed. You have to mentally train how you feel about your body the same way you physically train for your sport. We all have things that we love and then we all have things that we don't. But I don't think that you should shame yourself for, you know, not having the perfect body because no woman has the perfect body. A lot of women, they don't see in the mirror what they feel on the inside. So you can change that. We all have insecurities no matter how beautiful we are. Just love yourself and be happy in the skin you're in.